So for this problem, again, what they're asking us to do is write an expression um, for our indicated term. Well, our indicated term in this case is going to be 9. All right. So again, we notice that we have a ratio. So that's going to be our geometric sequence. So therefore, since we have a geometric sequence, we know that a sub n equals a sub 1 times r raised to the n minus 1. Yes? And then let's just plug in what we know. We want to figure out what a to the ninth power is, which equals a sub 1, which is 100 times r, which is e to the x, raised to the 9 minus 1. Well, we obviously know 9 minus 1 is just 8. So we have, why don't I write a 9? We're trying to figure out a to the ninth power. a to the ninth power equals 100 times e to the x times 8, or raised to the 8th power. And then what happens when you take an exponent? e to the x power, raise it to another exponent? You multiply them. And there we go. We can't evaluate e. We can't evaluate e raised to the 8x power because that x is a variable. So therefore, that's just going to be your final expression for your ninth term. Okay? That's it. Can't do any further with that.